Well, if you haven't looked at your home insurance coverage lately, the time to do so might be now. But the inflation impacting the housing market across the country, rebuilding your home after a natural disaster could prove costly. News Channel 7's Jamilka Gibson shows us what that means for homeowners. A rebuild, replace, and restore. If you haven't talked to your insurance company within the last two years, you need to raise your policy. Construction costs are on the rise. The chances are if you had a catastrophic event in your home tomorrow, it would not be enough to rebuild the home. One of the leading causes of those price hikes, material shortages. We've seen cost increases from everywhere from, you know, windows, sliding glass doors, cabinets, countertops, really just about everything that goes into the house, the cost have increased. A lot of that happened during COVID, and we expected to see that level off, which is done pretty much this year. Things like garage doors and cabinets and countertops, those costs have continued to rise, and they haven't gone back down. So what does that mean for the average homeowner? Trey Hutt with Hutt Insurance Agency breaks it down. What we all learned in Hurricane Michael is it can happen to us. And if you built a home for $250,000, and now it's going to cost more than three hundred thousand. We have that hurricane. You're going to run short fifty thousand dollars plus your deductible, plus some other expenses that may not be covered, and that's an awfully big hit to take. Another hit here in Bay County. Workers are hard to find. One of the unique things we're faced with here in the Panhandle are, are really the trade base. We don't have that many labor. Uh, subcontractors in our market. So the time to protect yourself is now because natural disasters can strike at any time and repairs won't come cheap. Call your agent and have a discussion. That's free and it probably would help you uh, in case there's something else that might be missing. Um, that's always a good first step. And no one wants to take a loss in their pocketbook after already losing a home in a storm. In Bay County, Jamoka Gibson, News Channel 7. Well, HUD says if you have questions about how much coverage to carry, talk to a professional like an insurance agent or a general contractor.